Hi, Jennifer Field here at the 52nd Annual Visionary Awards with ID8 TV. Here I'm with one of the presenters. She just got off the stage and presented Lily with her award. Uh, we have uh, Dee Johnson, producer. Uh, Dee, thank you so much for being here. My pleasure, my pleasure. Is this your first uh, uh, Visionary Awards? It is, actually. Oh, okay. It's very impressive. <laughs> Having a good time in there? I am. It, it's really been a lot of fun. It's really, really cool. A huge group. I had no idea it was going to be as big as it was tonight. Uh, how, how does it feel to be, you know, a part of that group and a part of the community um, that you're here with tonight? I'm sure you've seen some familiar faces or people know you. You know, um, uh, it's, it's a really special place to be a part of the East West Players, especially tonight. How does that feel for you? It's really interesting because actually I haven't been so super involved. I mean, I'm mostly in television. I don't do a whole lot of theater involvement. And um, it's been really great to be surrounded by so many because the reality of my television experience is there aren't really that many people who are Asian Americans that are actually, um, I mean, it's getting better, but it's, it has been a, a long, hard row, you know, so it's, it's been really wonderful being here tonight with a, with a bunch of folks. Yeah, how, how, how does that feel for you, you know, being a woman and, um, you know, being a woman of color, you know, now that this is kind of bit of a buzzword and people are talking about it the last year but does that feel empowering for you that that people are starting to really recognize and make efforts and inclusion writers and things like that that may be going on now oh yeah I mean it's great because I didn't grow up with any of these sort of role models so it's really nice having it happen and it has gotten better mm -hmm. but still have a long way to go mm -hmm. as I told my little story in there but you know it, it's you know the, I've been uh, in television for a long long time and and I was telling Lily earlier that I have only been on one other writing staff with another Asian, so it's mm -hmm. it's changing, slow, but it's getting there, you know. And this and stuff like this really helps. And tell us about your relationship with Lily. You know, you guys, old friends, or like, have you worked together? Like, well, we were, I was on ER for she was on ER for a whole lot longer. <laughs> I just I just sort of dipped in for five seasons and dipped out, you know. And uh, so we connected then, and we stayed in touch. And I was aware, you know, she, she, we, I knew she had done her movie and, and other things and so we stayed in touch and then, uh, and then when an opportunity came along to have her come on to Nashville, she, she called me up and I said, do, absolutely, come on, let's do this. And so she directed her first uh, network uh, television episode on Nashville of all things. I see, I see. And I'm sure she, I'm sure she did. There, you know. <laughs> I'm sure she did an amazing job. It was probably the best episode of the series. She kicked ass. She totally did it. She rocked it. Awesome. Thank you so much, Dee. You're welcome. My pleasure. <laughs> Jennifer Field with ID8 TV.